Hello, everybody. I'm Keith. I'm Christine's brother. Um, and I'm kind of pulling double duty today. I'm here as Christine's brother, but I'm here also kind of as a proxy for my dad. Um, and I've been kind of hearing his voice in the back of my head all day. Don't make me cry. <laughs> Uh, there were times when we were kids and we'd be all sitting around at the dinner table and Christine would do something silly or ridiculous and my dad would say something to my mom to this effect. Somewhere out there, there's an oblivious little boy playing his video games and he has no idea what's coming his way. <laughs> I remember this clear as day. I'm, I'm sure Christine and my mom do. Guess what, Daniel? You are that oblivious little boy. <laughs> together over four years ago and if you had told me we'd be standing here today celebrating our wedding I never would have believed it. Christine, you have shown me the bonds of partnership through both the easy and the rough times. You have been there for both anger and sadness, guilt and gratefulness, loss and blessing. Through all of this you have stood by me. Today you stand before us prepared to share the rest of your lives together. Before today, your parents provided you with a foundation of love and caring, and that nurture has been part of what brought you here. We will start by combining soil from Christine's childhood home and soil from Daniel's childhood homes. This combined soil has both literally and figuratively been part of the support system for these two persons. In 2018, I thought I was meeting my neighbor. I didn't realize I was meeting my husband. I am so profoundly honored and lucky to become your wife today. With you, I know life will never lack excitement, adventure, and laughter, but I also know we will face great challenges together. I am honored to be here today with you, and I vow through every moment, the happy, the sad, the easy, and the challenging, that we will always be in this together. Although we will spend the rest of our lives together, forever does not seem long enough. Until the end, I, Daniel Reagan, promise to protect, honor, cherish, respect, and most importantly, love you with everything that I am. My vow to you, Christine, is to love you and make the most of our life together. Whether the road becomes hard or tumultuous, I vow to be your partner, confidant, friend, support, and husband forever. Love you more. <laughs> I love you more, Daniel. You are my greatest adventure. Christine has often spoken of Daniel's kindness and his generosity and his thoughtfulness. I remember her calling me to say that she had met someone special when she was freezing in New York, and he sent her a care package including a warm blanket. From the start, it was clear that Christine had met someone worthy of her love and her support.